Bad Key The subway flies over the tracks through Aberdeen. Monsoon humidity clings to your skin as if it's followed you from Haley. Or perhaps it's simply sunk this far into the earth. Penetrating stone and machine, rousing the acrid smells of Hong Kong's underground in its wake. You've been handed a promising job. Geomantic sabotage, with a single objective. Disrupt the flow of Wu Xing Qi to destabilize, destabilize the corporation. Your client is especially keen on the idea of Wu Xing's famed geomancy being used against it, the ultimate humiliation. While the corporation's office spaces are free game, the main target is Wu Xing's treasured lotus statue, which resides within a temple on the topmost floor of the monolithic building. Your client's instructions are clear. The more damage you do, the worse the key, and the better the pay. Let's go make a big mess. Alright, so team, Gobbit, how you doing girl? See, you've got spells. Oh, you already have rank 2? Really? You already have aim a oh, wild aim 2. Let's see, last three rounds. Next closest ally will be affected, so that's just better. Do I, does it have to be its own slot? Oh, required spellcasting 5? Does Gobbit not have a spellcasting stat of 5? Also, can I even look at her that closely? Preview? Does she not have spellcasting 5? Yeah. Wow, Gobbit can't use that spell, apparently. Interesting. Anyway, I guess we'll just move forward then. An entire quest about making a mess? Count me in! We have a spoofed ID. We need to gain access to the executive offices. The subterranean access way opens to one of the Wuzing Sky Tower's few employee-only entrances. As only underground access as the only underground access point to Wuzing's restricted levels, security is tight. It's unheard of for unauthorized personnel to reach the upper levels. Naturally, that's where you're headed. Gobbit presses a slip of laminated plastic into your hand. A grainy black and white reproduction of your own face stares back at you. The rest of the card is filled with a barcode. She leans in to whisper to your ear. Kindly wa wanted you to have this. Spoofed credentials, fresh off the Maximum Laws card printer. You should get the, this, they should get you past the front door. Wouldn't count on them getting us much further though. I guess that the client said something about other ways to bypass the check-in system inside the building. But she couldn't get into specifics. She shrugs. Kindly had some choice words about that, but whatever. We'll have to find a way past security. Almost on cue, a sturdy woozing security officer peers up at you from behind a desk office, a desk console. Evening, sir. Swipe yourself in. You gestures the ID scanner in front of him. All right. We'll s <laughs> pull your weapon on him. Here are my credentials. No, swipe the spoofed credentials. Silly. God, the fact that you can just do that immediately. He looks at his counsel, then back at you. His eyebrows rise, and he observes your company. You realize your credentials only allow you access to floor 10, right? Ooh, a charisma score is actually going to come in handy. Of course. I have new credentials with guest privileges waiting for me inside. That's why I'm here, to pick them up. The officer nods curtly. Right. Go ahead and grab your new creds at the check-in terminal. Terminal. Have a nice day. I mean, have a good night, sir, because it's night time. Yay! I tricked him. He fell for me and my amazing, charming personality. See, I have quirks sometimes. I'm charming when I don't have to know about specific things about technology and spiritualism that aren't related to my interests. Just gonna wander on back here. There's a security checkpoint that I probably don't have access to. There's the check-in point. There's a door over here. Ooh, a jack-in point. We can probably use that too. Let's see here. Welcome to a single employee check-in station. <laughs> I could just kick the bottom panel and start yanking out wires. As funny as that sounds, that seems like a really bad idea. Uh, check in. Please enter your employee credentials. Spoofed ID. Credentials expired or incorrect. Any further attempts to access the terminal before refreshing your employee credentials will alert security. Uh, okay. Let's, uh, let's see if Isabel can do something about that. Hey, Isabel, you want to jack in real quick? Maybe solve all my problems, since, uh, apparently we may have some problems here. So you want to help? 
maybe you could like, you know, uh, restore a few credentials here and there. All right, Matrix. It's like, kind of hard to imagine bringing, not bringing Isabelle on a run. The Matrix stuff just kind of feels kind of important. So how do I get past that guy? Oh, you can kind of hide in the little dock, the little nub over there, right over here. Oh, didn't quite, almost didn't nail that. There we go. Hack that IC, bro. Oh yeah, the countdown's not even going down at first. And I can just, so this gives me more time each time. That barely even gives you more time. Whatever. Seems like kind of a waste of time. W, 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 uh, W? Da, da, this one. <laughs> I immediately homed in on the right one. God, that's actually really easy. Maybe I never have to play with a stupid key code thing ever. Doesn't seem to be particularly mandatory. Oh, there's bad guys. Oh, we're fighting now. Okay. Didn't really have a chance to avoid detection there. Ah. Uh, guess I'll throw in a. Assassin and a shield guy. Oops, I accidentally moved instead of shooting. Fuck. That's a bummer. Well, assassin guy, you can assassinate. I accidentally moved towards this guy, so let's try to. Oh, wow. That worked out for you. Way to go, assassin. You got more powerful. Wow. There's some damage. All right, Isabel. Let's just see if I can just wipe it out right now. Your, uh, your line of sight's blocked, huh? Well, fine. Let's throw out the shield character. Maybe he'll have line of sight, or at least enough actions to do an attack. Let's see if I can get him. Love me! Wow, that worked perfectly. They didn't even get an attack. Only have a system trace of 10 right now. Heat suppression routine. That sounds fun to hack. Uh, let's go for it. 25 seconds. That's a little rough. Uh. Fuck it. Go, go, go. Alright, next. Uh, this double circles over here. Uh, this line. Yes. Yeah. That's the right one. Well, I'm getting the hang of that pretty quickly. <laughs> Yay, a heat suppression routine. What does that do? I'm sure it's good. It's in the matrix and Isabel can touch it. It's probably good. It's probably good. That or it's, or it's, uh, it is a little hard to tell sometimes if I'm doing something helpful or if I'm just grabbing something I can sell. Oh shit, I thought I was, I thought I was hidden there. Uh, buddy, you're gonna have to get out of my fucking personal space, you hear me? You hear me, bro? You need, to, you need to step it. You need to step on back. All right, well, that's a little bit more trace. Ooh! Ooh! Oh, crap. I accidentally walked into him. That's not what I was going for at all. Hit him in the face! Thankfully, I have three AP in here, so... Gives me a little bit of an edge. I can almost just get away with fighting my way through here. All right, I can go left or right. I'll have to remember there's a T-junction back here. Well, we're in for a fight now, aren't we? Well, that looks important. Uh, let's definitely summon some dudes. Since apparently we have enough enemies around here that I'm going to want to have them around. If for no other reason, then just have more actions per turn. Alright, Assassin, we'll start with you, because you do the highest damage. Out of my two summons. Ah, instant kill, there you go. There we go, Isabel. Go for the kill. All right, two tough, two big tough guys are out already. Now what can Shield Guy accomplish? Fifty-five percent chance is garbage. Let's get closer. Maybe they'll target you first. Also, uh, sixty-eight and seventy. Let's shield. Everyone, shoot me. I'm I'm vulnerable to your attacks. All right, uh, Assassin Guy. Uh, Isabel, let's move forward. See who I can target correctly. I think I should be in a nice and vulnerable position, right? 76%. Got him. Can I go for the killing blow? No, I can't, apparently. Alright. 
assassin guy. Let's move forward. Can you shoot the other guy? Oh, you can't do assassinate again. All right, well, let's see if I can finish him off with the shield guy because he's weaker. Come on. There we go, he's down. Now we'll just get attacks in with these characters on the remaining guy. There we go. Oh, he tried. The main thing happening here is he's just getting more trace. Oh, my main attack missed. That's not a, that's not great. Tar blast, motherfucker. Dodge that. That didn't really do any damage. That was kind of a bummer. All right. Oh, I hit the wall. Do I need? Oh yeah, that thing is alert to us, huh? Forgot about that. It just looks so non-threatening. In fact, it looks like part of the background. But I forget that it's an actual combatant sometimes. Come on. Oh, really, man? This, it must have a high dodge chance. I've, I've been told that the uh, hit chance is just the first calculation, when, when it tells you your chance of hitting on the uh, is that number. But there's also an additional number of, like, its chance of avoiding the attack after it's supposed to hit. That may be more different. Oh, is he just not hostile? Maybe it's not hostile. Alright, hacking time. Eh, 40 seconds is enough, right? All right, what do I get? Uh, line, two, two lines. B -b 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 these ones. W, M, W, M. Is it a circle? No. Oh, shit. Uh, oh, there it is. Yeah. I was off by one symbol. There we go. All right. Administrative override. There we go. Security override. That'll get me in. I love you, Isabel. You make it easier to not shoot everybody on the way through here. So many people are alive and don't even know it because of you. Alright. Patrol situation. Is everyone just going back on a pattern? Oh yeah, they're not overlapping paths. They're all connected. Well, let's see here. I can go hide in this little divot over here. At the very least. Oh, I can follow you into here. Uh, go ahead in here. Wait for him to come by. He's going, that guy's gonna turn around. Oh, quickly, quickly. Oh God, how far does the screen go? I thought I was at the end already. I didn't see this last row here. We're good though. All right, come on. All right, what do we have? We have like a minute. Uh, this one has a symbol, W, symbol W, symbol W, there we go. W, uh, what was the far left one? Was it a, was it a line? Uh, I think it's this one. Yes. Alright. Not much to talk about during that part, because I have to shut down old commentary just be like, Brain, don't forget things. But I'm usually good with patterns. Uh, there's pay data for sure, yeah, woozing delivery manifest. So we have something about the heat situation. Oh yeah, I can just eject. I don't have to walk back out. I did it. So we dealt with some kind of heat problem and we dealt with our, I believe we dealt with our credentials. So I can just kick it. Use security override to gain administrative access. Welcome admin, alter existing cr uh, credential clearance. Granted, you are now able to act, uh, alter the existing information and clearance level of the losing employee ID. Please select an ID to alter. Spoofed ID. Ta-da! Now we have heightened access employee ID. Suck it. Alright. Check in. And employee credentials. I got MR view credentials. Swipe spoofed ID. What do you mean expired or incorrect? We've heightened the shit. What? Are you fucking with... I already... Fuck you, I just got super right. I got super credentials just now. Why are you telling me they're bad? What's in here? I'll just go check the other check-in and just assume that works out. There's an employee over here. Is this like a dressing room? Who's this guy? A couple of wage slaves. I'm amble through their... Amble about their business inside the corporate locker room. The closest room man to you flings a jacket into a locker and then turns towards the showers. He stops short when he catches sight of you. His wary eyes widen in surprise. Oh, the security etiquette. Interesting. Ah, good, good evening. He glances behind him and assured, and assured by something turns back towards you with a smile. I'm Charles. Haven't seen your face before. Are you new here? 
Now I'm just here to trash the place. Jesus. New to this building. Uh, I know how that goes. I'm pretty new here myself. Still learning the ropes. Any tips for a fellow neophyte? Yeah. Upper flows are off limits. Highly restricted. He glances around, lowers his voice. Not sure what's happening up there, but only company execs, security, and maintenance have access. I wonder if I can just pretend to be maintenance. Are they allowed up there at hours like this? I don't see why not. They're called 24-7. But that's not my department, so I don't say for sure. Gotcha. Thanks for your help. Anytime, friend. Good luck. We're gonna get along so great when I never see you again. Unless it turns into a bloody shootout and then I tragically kill you later. I was like, no! He said he was my friend! And he's dead now. Oh, so sad. Please insert your Wuzing employee identification card. Please? Yeah, it's accepted. Welcome, Mr. C. Pang. Have a nice day. Have a nice evening. Mr. C. Pang, the terminal air chip of recognition. Everybody checks, everything checks out here. Thanks. C. Pang. I might have to remember that's my name, so let's try to think about that. All right. Hello, door. Open for me. What's in here? Access to offices. This pristine, hyper-sterilized office glistens as if every surface has been polished. Your client has requested that this area be manipulated as subtly as possible so, as not, so as not to draw attention from the temple. The true defacement will happen there, distracting Wu Xing's security. Hopefully they will, won't discover the disrupted key flow on this floor for weeks. Alright, so we're making a little mess down here, a sinister one, a small one. And then we're making hell upstairs. Hopefully no one will be up here to notice me. So, objectives. Gain access to the temple, disrupt key in the offices, disrupt key flow 50%, 75%, 100%. So, 50% is the minimum, 75 and 100% will probably get me more pay, but also maybe give me more chance of being caught? I don't know. Key point found. I'm doing the opposite of what I did at the beginning of the game. Alright, that's 10% disruption. What did I do? Aw, oh, you're not going to be fun about it? That's kind of a bummer. When we were at the walled... When we were at the, uh, wall... The walled city. Light and dark balance is key to maintaining good key. When we, is that coming from me? Am I actually saying that? That's kind of cool. That I'm actually explaining things like a character. Uh... Because that, that is my specialty, after all. It's just, uh... Wow, that's really weird that there's so much staggered light here, too, to just stress what we just talked about. In the Walled City, there was an explanation about every single weird key thing I was doing. Right now, they're kind of, like, weirdly not talking about it. Is this one gonna... Okay, this one might have... Nope. Nope. They just kind of happen. All right. That's kind of a bummer. They had In the Walled City, they had kind of fun little scenarios they explained for how you were fixing each little bit of key. This one's just like, eh, there's a key spot over here, and then you're like, I touched it. And they're like, I did it! Are there any spots around here? Is that it? Oh, whoa, it's a bunch of, bunch of pops. All these spots just popped up. Was I missing stuff a second ago? My alt, my, uh, alt wasn't making pop-ups a second ago. Oh, key point pound. Key foit pound, did I just say that? Goddamn. Squelch the flames. Aha! Ruining your flames, all your fire and shit. Alright, it might, might just take a little while to load your, uh, quick, your little, uh, tooltip locations. So, is anyone here to catch me today, tonight, is the question. This one says, Power Junction. The generator rests unguarded before you. A shock to the system could compromise the computer main frame powers. Do I want to overload the generator? Use the passcode to overload the generator. I don't have the code, though. Do I? Security override. Pay... Nope. No passcode. Also, not sure why I want to overload the generator. Can I use any of these things around here? Not really. Close combat defense bonus. Next door. We're gonna be thorough. Ooh, big office. Big empty office? Oh. We're gonna move this divider, apparently. There we go. Now it's asymmetri- Now it's all asymmetrical. What are you gonna do? How are you gonna survive as a person? Oh shit! Get wrecked! <laughs> Am 
mess with the desk. Oh, we can really mess with this room. Man, fuck your room. That doesn't sound good. Yeah, it sounds like company. Uh-oh. They're gonna be mad at me for slightly moving things around in their office. They're gonna be really unhappy. Uh... I mean, that's probably gonna fuck with the key in this room, right? If we just straight up kill dudes down here. Oh! What? Are you... We're being attacked by spirit elementals? Did I make the key too bad in here? Bound nature spirit. Alright, well... Bound nature spirit's about to learn a little thing about killing hands, I think. And... Gobbit, how about you give me a speed boost? Especially since now it doesn't even use your whole turn anymore. There we go. Aha! I still have- I still have a bunch of extra moves now. So you're gonna be in trouble. Let's go for the stun, first of all. That- it's immune to stunning. Alright, good to know. D never try that again. Uh, quick strike. For the free hit. Stride, counter strike, manifest- Ah, uh, let's start hitting him a lot in the face. Probably a legit strat there. Yeah. There we go. All them punches, how you gonna deal with it? Alright. Isobel? Ah, uh, let's have Gaichu attack next instead. Let's see, coup de gras. Only works on stun targets, so that's not gonna help me here. So let's just go stabby stab. How you feeling? Feeling good? Is he dead? Oh yeah, he's dead. Looked a little weird for a moment there. A little, a little hard to tell. That's uh... Let's set up an overwatch cone for when he attacks me. I'll go attack him if he comes if he comes after me. Similarly... Isabel, can you reach this guy? 89% chance of hitting, that's good. Damn. Damn, girl. Alright. All we can do with Gobbit really is get closer at this point. Ow. Yeah, they're not, they're not gonna approach, are they? They're just gonna attack with from a range. I think I- maybe I messed with the feng shui of, of one room too aggressively. Are they fighting each- The elementals are attacking each other. Yeah, I just made a mess of this whole room then, didn't I? Alright, well, I'll let those guys fight each other. It gives me an excuse, excuse to focus on the other dude. Let's go stabby stab. There we go. Water stance, go! Alright. Go for the hit. That's my first move, and it missed, unfortunately. Counter-Strike, Stride, Manifest, Purges- goes through armor. He does have armor, so why not? There we go. Your armor's been pierced, motherfucker. How's that feel? Probably not very good, and stuff. He's hiding behind a rock, isn't he? Oh, is he- did I just kill him? Oh, I just killed him. Okay. <laughs> that moment when you can't quite tell in time. What about aimed shot? 70%- Oh, 99% chance. Why is you- why are you so easy to hit? Oh, light cover versus medium cover? That's probably it. That's a three cooldown dead eye shot from- Wow, you have a, a skill called that? Increased accuracy by 20% pierces three armor. So her aimed shot just got way better. Also have the exploded shot. That's all, gotta be all part of her leveling up. Blow him up! Alright, well, that was a good shot. Congratulations. We still have more shots to do though, so... Da -da 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 -da. All right, we're off to a good start. Now shoot him in the face. That's a lot of nines happening. I don't think they're gonna recover from that very quickly. All right, Gobbit. We need to move forward before we can attack anything, so get up there. And at this point, I'm gonna say spray and pray. Let's go for the other guy. There we go, not a very good shot. I was hoping to spread out the shots between these two guys so that if they fight each other, they're more likely to hurt each other. One damage, congratulations. Really should have had you cast a spell on, on someone else instead. Oh, this, did shooting you guys make you not interested in fighting each other anymore? I don't appreciate the way you're be behaving right now, sir. I'm gonna have to punish you. Whoopsie. God damn, Isabel, you got scary at some point, didn't you? Alright, well, you're very far away, handyman. I don't know if you noticed that. Can I actually reach that guy? I think I can. Alright, go for it. Chuka 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 chuka. Damn. That's speed, though. You know, once you have that many many AP points, you can just go cruising along. Alright, so I think I did too much aggressive... De of, uh, key... Or too much aggressive key... De words are hard sometimes when we talk for, like, three hours straight playing a game. Uh, I think I was too aggressive with my key disrupt disruption in this area. And maybe... 
led to a fight happening because I play, played too much with one little area. Ooh, safes. You can open it with quickness or security code, or you can get the code yourself. Welp, don't know if I got the code. I don't think, I still don't have a code, right? Yeah, those are not codes. And unfortunately, these other characters in my party apparently aren't very helpful in this, in this regard. See, I wonder if that happened because I was too aggressive, or if it just happens every 25%, maybe. Another fight happens, perhaps. Could be interesting. If all these fights are happening just because I'm playing- Oh, I start- I start playing with furniture and suddenly the spirits attack me. Key point found. Crack mirrors. I hate mirrors. Get out of here. Let's see. They want the key disruption to be subtle, but there- it says optionally to go up to 100%. Which seems really unsubtle. I'm like, yeah, let's break all the mirrors in every room. No big deal. It's normal. No one will catch up with that. A prototype weapon sits locked in a stand. Its locking mechanisms are se seemingly tied into the weapon's operation and safety, forcing it could damage the weapon. Oh. Can we do something about that? Losing research terminal main menu. Welcome user. Please select from the following options. Several folders appear in second window below the first. Only a couple look useful. You can search the woozing floor plan documents or read the weapon manual's specifications. What about the floor plan? <clears throat> Amidst the documents, a fellow, a few nuggets of information stand out. A section dedicated to the woozing's building key details the geomancy plans and renovations they've made to increase key flow. It appears that woozing's already made hundreds of minuscule and a handful of not so minuscule adjustments to its floor plans and building infrastructure. A recently updated file marks its project to add new water lines to the temple's fountain as complete. The document ends with a large list of future modifications that the company has queued for, con for completion, all the ways to improve its positive energy output. Losing's research terminal main menu. Welcome user. Please select from the following options. All right. Weapon manuals and specifications. You click the folder and a large repository of files containing Woozing Research Project pops up. One section is labeled with a symbol similar to the markings of the weapon just a few feet from you. A quick scan from the data reveals information on the weapon and lab setup. Don't have pistol of five and I don't have intelligence of six. So that's a dead end apparently. All right. We're not gonna get anything else out of that. Again, nothing new popped up from the for me looking at the floor plans. Don't see a lot of key opportunities in here. I've already been in that room. And I've already been in that room actually. So we'll head into the next area. What's up here? That's a big important looking spot. Search the desk. Ooh, something to read. Uh, the notes are stacked neatly around, ordered and cleared. The number is circled several times on one sheet. 8484. Ooh, key point. Fuck your window, bro. Fuck your window. All right, it four it four and a temple access card. Well, that's straightforward for getting to the temple. It's probably the staircase in the bottom corner. No more key points immediately found. I wonder how extensively I'm supposed to search for this kind of thing. Is there more stuff stashed around here that I didn't see the first time around? How many of their little boards can I move around without them noticing? I feel like they're gonna notice that their desk is sticking out, all dumb looking. <laughs> Alright, so I have a password to either a computer terminal... It could be a, t a computer terminal, or it could be something else. Let's see. Use a passcode. 8484. That was it. Alright, so that's not the key the code to the door, apparently. Well, we still haven't hit 50%, so let's try this. Overload the power settings. Uh, 50%. I sense that we've thoroughly upset this building's energy. All that remains is the vandalization of the temple statue. And then we must go. The key here has become too... turbulent. Should I leave? The key is becoming more and more turbulent. It has reached a point where this churning energy has a physical manifestation visible in the atrium. The disruptions are working. That's freaky looking. And I'm wondering if I should just head out. Is this how you get to the temple over here, probably? Can I open this door? Apparently not. But yeah, I'm not seeing a lot of other opportunities around here. I'm holding the button to show tooltips. 
I don't see a lot of evidence about other ways in. Let's check that lockbox. What if it's passcode's also 8484? That'd be pretty embarrassing, right? Uh, enter code 8484. What? It's also the code to this place. 150 credits. Nailed it. Yeah, I don't know how to get past 50%, but at least that's the objective done, so... Now we just need to find our way to the temple. And I don't necessarily know how to get to the temple, actually. Just drop key in the offices, complete, and now gain access to the temple. The temple... maybe I accessed that from the elevator? Oh, is that the other elevator? I think I came into the other one. That's, yeah, I think I came into the top one, so maybe this bottom one's the uh, temple? Where have I gone? Oh, that's the temple, alright. Alright. Disrupt the key in the temple. Maybe here you also get another 50%. Maybe the first 50% was the first area. Oh, bad guys. Who is a bunch of evil spirits? Yes, you are. Oh, positive key disruption gave a bunch of people one, one, one willpower, apparently. Probably want to wait for them to come to us to some extent, because I can shoot at them as they come. So you, can you shoot over this thing? Heavy cover. They're from the rocks? Oh, in the open. 43% chance of hitting. 50% chance of hitting. So I'm going to want to move forward first. Let's go for... I can go for steady shot if I want. 91% chance of hitting. And I missed! Sweet. That's what I was hoping would happen. I'm so proud of you right now. Um, let's see here. Lingering area effect that does HP. It's the acid fog area. What hap- where's her wall skill? There it is. It's a plague barrier fetish. So she can only use one then. I assume it comes back every time, otherwise why would it be, why would it be part of her level up system? And then there's the, f the elementor, uh, elemental fetish. Let's see, this is a high damage plague barrier, what does it look like? Is it just that one spot? It said it created s three spots, right? Huh. Let's put it right in front of that guy, maybe? Oh. Probably use it to block that area so he can't come through, unless, he can, unless he'll run around it. I don't know. It's interesting. Let's speed someone up. Like our tank character. Hey, handyman, you want to go make a mess? Yeah, I think you want to make a mess. Killing hands. Let's go make a mess. 75% versus 72%. 48 crit, 48 crit. Eh, they're both valid. This one's closer, I think. Punchy, punchy. Punchy, oh no. That was my whole turn. That's a bummer. But now I can flank him. That probably will help. Get in there, got you. Make daddy proud? No. There we go. There's some actual damage happening. Are we all gaining an extra willpower over and over again? That wasn't nice. You took away one fourth of my extensive armor. How will I survive? Nope, there's more coming in. Is he gonna walk through it? He totally walked through it. Oh, he's immune? At least he lost AP, I guess. But it's it's a bummer that he's immune to the actual attack. Oh, I forgot to do quick strike last time. Make up for that real quick. Punch you in the face. 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 I get so many attempts. Hey, Isabel, this person's right in your face. We should probably do something about that, like by shooting him in the face. There you go. That's pretty much the right approach. Shoot the crap out of this guy in his dumb face. You did it! Congratulations, Isabel. You did your one job. Ooh, did he just die? I think he just died. Oh, we're getting key disruption just from fighting these things. There's other disruption points in the area, too. Alright, Gobbit. Oh, you still have moves. Where's the bad guy? Way down there? Yeah. We might as well disrupt key while we're here. Since the enemies aren't immediately in the area yet. Aha, I'm messing with the key in the middle of the fight. Fuck it. Oh, that place is on fire. Well, that's... I feel kind of bad. But not that bad, you know? Like, like marginally bad. Is there, like, heavy cover around here anywhere? No, they're all trees. That doesn't help me very much. Eh, hey, let's go. Let's take, a, take cover over here. Wow, you look like you're going fast. All right, Gobbit. You see any key disruption locations? Not necessarily. 
You should probably back Isabelle a bit so she doesn't get in trouble. Oh yeah, that bonus aim will probably help. Oh, healing. That'll probably help too. You know what? Let's move forward into the middle of this crazy circle that helps with your cooldowns probably. Let's see. Dragon line medium. Yep. So let's heal a bit. Hey, 14 hit points. That's not bad. And give aim to Isabel. There we go. Come at me, spirits. Oh no, now we get now we lost willpower. Probably because of the thing we just did over there where we ruined stuff. Sorry. Alright, so Isabel. Let's try to get into position over here. Ish. Stay away from the fire stuff. Oh, I can actually... Oh, I can go in that to get full cover. Cause it, right, because that stuff helps me. Well, I forgot. Uh, shoot him in the face. We have a really high chance of hitting. That's not very high damage, though. It's cool. You tried, I guess. All right. Can you reach him, Gaichu? You can. Ruin him. God damn, my melee characters have gotten really fast. Is he dead yet? Not quite. All right. Can you reach all the way down there? Yeah? Go for it. Please hit. There we go. Fight over? Apparently fight is over. Oh, there's one over there, though. We just haven't noticed him yet, I guess. Any more keep uh, spots to mess with? Eh, we'll just go fight that guy. He's already here. Get that part out of the way. Not the disruption of the willpower. Ow. Rude. Excuse me, sir. Don't appreciate your attitude. Gonna have to ask you to... Ah, uh, let's get the speed to Gaichu. Gaichu seems to use it pretty well. Uh, let's see. It'll use a lot of turns just to get to him. Probably avoid killing hands this time just because it, it'll use a whole turn when he might be the only guy left anyway. Ah, oh, I missed. Skychu, you I buffed you and sent you all the way down there, and you don't even connect your attacks. How do I even reconcile this fact? All right, go for the hit. We'll get one hit here now. Bam! Oh, that's your whole turn. Okay. Isabel, move forward a bit. Go for that nice, clean shot. Eighty percent chance of hitting. Very pretty high crit. There we go. That's how you do it. Uh, Gobbit, move forward a bit, because you don't even have line of sight right now. Can you even shoot at him? Oh, he turns over, because you already buffed someone, right? Don't shoot at people, that's not nice. And also, don't mess up with my frame rate, asshole. Uh, Gaichu, redeem yourself. There you go, that's why I sent you down there. Congratulations, you tried. Crack the water pipe? I hate pipes. Yeah, that's a crack. <laughs> Very subtle disruption of key right there. Anything else around here? Looking for chances to mess with things. It's a really nice garden, too. Kind of feel like a dick. But they seem to be a shitty corporation anyway, so, you know. Eh. Eh. What's over there? There's a circle. Sp oh, that's the bad key spiral from downstairs. It's the same central piece. Alright, let's see how much the statue does. Yeah, I only need 15%. The statue might be that last 15%. It is. Alright, karma gained for doing the full disruption of the key. Now we just want to get out of here, right? Yeah. Yep, escape losing tower, and we're going to have company, aren't we? Oh! Oh, those look like employees. They're probably not here to fight. A well-dressed ma dressed man steps forward, his peers staring smugly in your direction. His clothes are smart and clearly expensive but lack the typical padding worn by guards and thugs. A quick look at him associates, his associates reveals the same style. Mages. Uh-oh. On behalf of Wuzing Incorporated, we've been instructed to prevent at your further vandalizing of the company's property and assets. However, they never specified how. So I vote we do this the easy way. The mage motions to you with a flick of his wrist. Leave no survivors. Oh, we gonna have a fight. I wish I still had that fetish that would throw poison everywhere, because... Uh, well, I guess they're gonna move anyway. It would have been nice to put it in that doorway. Ooh, please tell me you're all gonna group up in a nice cluster. That sounds like fun for someone who has explosive weaponry that can shoot right there. 50% chance. I'll take that chance. Boom. That's, that's disappointing. I'm disappointed in you, Isabel. Try it again. Why do you exist? 
Oh, well, that happened. All right, so that happened. Well, they're mages. They're probably not very good at getting stabbed. So what if we just give haste to guide you? And a nice big case of bonus aim to guide you. And then Gaichu, with his amazing accuracy and speed, as a red samurai, is going to chop some dumb fucking heads off with his 96% chance of hitting. Right? Is he dead yet? Not dead yet. Try again. Nope, that's less dead than before. You're doing worse. Ah, uh, still alive. Is he gonna bleed at least? Maybe they'll bleed a lot. Let's go killing hands. Try to stun someone, if I can reach them. Please get a stun. Uh, oh, hoo -hoo. All right, I'm not entirely impressed. Try to go for the killing shot. All right, we got that at least. That's one down. Otherwise, not the best use of a turn, but I tried. Ooh, they're all clustering around. Ow, Jesus, 32 damage. Okay, I'm in trouble here. Uh, Isobel, would you like to heal me a little bit? Because I'd really appreciate it. There we go. Well, it's so nice if you guys don't all cluster around me like this. Fuck y'all. <laughs> hey, uh, Gaichu, you, what can you do to help out? Because things not so great, you know? In fact, what if I, I don't have a stun, do I? I already used that and it failed. Quick strike. Uh, low hit points, not really in any of these cases. Uh, that guy. That uh, didn't work either. Alright, uh, Gaichu, let's go for a, a, few, a few hits here. Please. Where are you go- What? Didn't I click on the character? Not all the way over- What? What'd you do? Fuck it, hit this guy. I thought I clicked on the bad guy. I don't know why he went that way. Are you dead? Nope. Like it if you were more dead. There you go. There you go. See, it's not that hard. Isabel, what can you do for me, lady? Yeah, see? That's nice. Put a bunch of holes in these people. Alright. Got it. Um Acid Fog and Rat Totem. Today they don't have any spirits. I can give bonus aim to someone, basically. Let's give bonus aim to Handyman so he stops missing, because that's been a problem lately. Spray and pray, that has a chance of it hitting AoE. Which would be bad for my character that's already wounded, so aimed shot. Still a bad shot chance of hitting too. 10. That's something at least. Alright. Let's make a mess, handyman. There you go. That's a big old hole in his body. Fuck y'alls. Yeah, that's a crit. How you feeling about that? You, sh you sure you guys don't want to run away? Oh, you healed him a little bit. Oh, you healed him a lot. You healed him by ha half his hit points. You're oh, cool. You're attacking the guys over there that aren't the b people that I'm worried about, really. Alright, Gaichu, you go chase that guy because he's trying. He's going to make things difficult for us by running away. And you've got the crazy speed right now. There we go, that's half your actions. There we go. It's a bit of progress. You deal with this guy. Let's try to stun him real quick so he doesn't do any more moves, maybe. There we go, that'll stop him for a while. Uh, Manifest will break his armor. That'll help us out, and then just punch him. There we go. Isobel, can you even shoot that guy? 52% chance is not a great chance of hitting. Although you don't need that good of a hit either, do you? Spray and pray, 40% chance, it's even worse. Ah, let's take a few shots. Come on. There we go, we actually got it. Let's blast him away. We can actually finish this, I think, right now. Oh, come on. Come on, girl. You can do- yeah. Last possible shot of <laughs> the entire turn, got the kill. Alright, well good job, security. You really did your job. In that you died, you died for the company. So congratulations on that, I guess. Uh, I can escape the woozing sky tower. Sweet. We're good to go then. Out of here. As you reach for the elevator's control panel, you can feel the electric sensation of the key dancing across your skin. This feeling is noticeable to those not even magically attuned. The disruption here is that strong. Behind you, the trapped and turbulent key swirls inside the iconic. Sky Tower, <clears throat> Sky Tower Atrium. You can actually see the air around the atrium warp and ebb as the key surges and breaks against the obstacles around you. Uh, looking for a way to move, to flow, finding none. Your job is done. You have desecrated the Woozing Lotus, and in doing so, blemished the prideful face of a Megacore. 
I've seen a lot of things, but I've never seen or felt key this way. I imagine this is what it must feel like for an attuned, attuned person in the walled city. She shudders. Must be unbearable. The elevator arrives at the temple. Time to duck out of the back door before the security can respond further. Alright, let's get out of here. I think that went pretty okay. A lot of these fights, a lot of these missions don't look combat oriented, but then turn, up, turn out to be very combat oriented as it turns out. Hey, Wu Xing uh, won't know what hit them. The embarrassment on, of their own geomantic science turned against them will sit unfavorably on the tongues of Wu Xing executives and maybe even get a few people terminated. They'll know it wasn't just the building you battered. You, get, you sent a message. Everyone has a weakness that can be exploited. The change in feng shui should keep them spinning for months. The complete disruption of their key and destruction of their temple will cripple the energy at, at this branch of the, of the company, and with Wu Jing focusing on restoring their temple, it will be a long time before they discover the full extent of your assault. Sometimes the uh, dialogue is perfectly timed to the exact amount of time that it takes to load. So I'm sure different computers will load faster. Hell, I think my computer will load faster whenever I'm not recording. Sometimes just the simple process of making videos actually takes a toll on everything. Hey, we got eight karma again. All right, I think I'm just gonna put another point into willpower here and just wait and stop there. So yeah, I definitely have reasons to want to increase my key casting after some of the spells I've seen that I can get. So let's just put myself in a position to be ready for that. All right, now what about my payment? Claim payment for the Wu Zing sabotage run. He submitted as finished. Kindly Cheng. A little bird whispered in my ear that Wu Jing's fortunes are already falling. Their stock value is dropping by 2% already. The client finds that it is acceptable indication of your success and has forwarded payment. I've attached your cut to this email. And our cut was... Oh, it happened when the email got opened, so I didn't see it. Uh, let's see, Shadowland BPS. Claim payment for sold pay data. For the museum shipping manifest. Bam. 432. You make a lot of money from these, from just having Isabel grab this pay data. Like that's it's a substantial boost compared to like the actual money you make half the time for the missions. All right, the Woozing logistical data is now uploaded to be sold. Hopefully that'll work out well too. How much money do I have now anyway? Up to 4,000, wow. I walked out of that mission with, with 1,000, so I just got 3,000 overall. 